snow is primarily measured by its weight, and the weight of snow directly represents the amount of water that will come out of the snowpack. I'm Rachel Hallman, and I work here as a hydrologist in Yosemite. We've actually been measuring snow since the early 1900s through a process called the Snow Survey. Each month, surveyors across the park put on skis and ski out to remote locations to measure the snow. Surveyors use a long tube to take a cylinder of snow, or a core, and weigh that to determine how much water is in the snow. There are multiple snow survey locations across Yosemite, from Tuolumne Meadows to Gin Flat, all the way to the Glacier Point Road. We also have an automated network of weather stations that not only measure key parameters such as air temperature and relative humidity, but also are measuring the snow depth and the weight of snow. Adequate snowpack can also help to buffer against drought conditions and provide critical soil moisture that can reduce wildfire risk during the hot months of the summer. One of my favorite things about snow in Yosemite is during the spring when I get to go out into the forest and watch the snow start to melt off of the branches and run off into the creeks and they start to swell with all of that new water. And as you're hiking along, you see new plants and foliage start to emerge. It's a really special time.